Hey everybody, Ryan here at eTrailer. Today on our 2021 Ford F450, we're gonna be checking out the Kurt Gooseneck Ball and Safety Chain Anchor Kit for the trucks that have the OEM prep package. When it comes to these newer trucks, I think it's really awesome that not only Ford, but a lot of the other manufacturers now uh, started to include the OEM prep package. And it makes it super easy to put in a gooseneck ball kit like this one, or even a fifth wheel for that matter. Uh, Cause you drop them right in essentially, use them, you can pop them out and still have full bed access. You don't have no, nothing permanent really in here, uh, taking up away uh, or taking away any of your bed space. So I think it's really cool. And if you plan on doing some towing, I mean, chances are pretty good. You got an F450, pretty, pretty heavy duty truck. You're gonna want a kit that is just as reliable and can handle uh, what you wanna throw at it. And when it comes to these gooseneck um, ball kits, there's a few different options out there. I'll say, at least in my opinion, the Kurt one uh, kind of falls in the middle. That's just my opinion though. And you know, they're gonna have some advantages and disadvantages compared to each other. One of the, one of the good things about this one is the weight capacity. So a little more heavy duty than some of the other ones out there. This one is 38,000 uh, pounds, which assuming that 450 probably gonna have any issues with that. So if you have a really heavy trailer, would rather just have something that's built a little bit, you know, built a little bit more tough, um, this is definitely a good option for you. I talked about this kit kind of falling in the middle, uh, in my opinion, and one of the reasons I came up with that is partly due to the latch mechanism here on the ball. And so in, in terms of it staying connected, pretty much bulletproof because in order to get this out, you have to lift this up and spin it and then the ball will come out. So whenever the trailer is on here, obviously there's no, no chance this thing's gonna come up and spin and become disconnected, right? So um, definitely instills confidence there as far as that goes. But whenever you do go to take this out, you know, right now this is brand new, so I can't speak for a couple years down the road. I could be wrong, but I feel like that mechanism might be kind of hard to operate, especially you start getting some grease caked in there and everything else. Um, you know, it's hard to say, but I just foresee that potentially happening. So if it were me, I'd probably um, try to keep this somewhat clean. You know, I feel like get a little more use out of it, but it does have an advantage compared to let's say the Reese one, which uses a similar design, but this piece is plastic. So this is actually a metal one and I mean, it, it's not rocket science. You know what plastic does over time. It starts to degrade and get weak and brittle. And then if you break that off, you're kind of kind of just out of luck there. So at least with this one, you know it's not gonna break. Uh, the One of the other kits of BMW, it actually uses a big handle and then locks down. So that's pretty cool. The safety chain anchors, um, these things are no joke. They're, they're pretty stout. They got some weight to them. And the way they work is they'll drop in. Then you rotate it. A couple of parts here. Uh, you got a pin. And then you put this clip through it. That's going to prevent it from coming out. Uh, so, I mean, pretty uh, a surefire bet. You know, these aren't going to come disengaged as long as you set it up right. Um, this does have some larger openings in it there, which is good to see. But on the same note, they're so stout that uh, some hooks might not be big enough to get around it. So this one I could probably snap around, but probably be a pain to take off. This one is a 5 16 So if it were me, uh, just for easy use, if my trailer had this type on it or smaller, I'd probably go one up. Probably just e be easier to clip this into place and uh, uh, use it and that's something if you end up going with this kit and that's something you're looking to do We have a ton of different options as far as these go uh, right here at each trailer You do get a couple extra bonus items. I guess you could call them with this kit uh, one of them being a cover That goes into here. So if you end up losing your factory one or uh, just like this one better you know, that does come with that, which is a nice touch. I'd rather have an extra one and not need it than, than the other way around. And then it's also gonna come with the case and it's 
It's actually pretty nice. It almost reminds me of like a drill case. Uh, so there's cutouts and everything in this for you to put the ball and the, the anchors and everything else. That way you keep everything organized. It's all together. And you know, whenever you're not using it, you pop it in here, throw it under the back seat in the toolbox or uh, whatever the case may be. Other than that though, at the end of the day, I mean, not really a whole lot to it. Um, you know, it's gonna come with everything you need to get you going and, and hook up your gooseneck trailer and, and towing it down the road. Uh, when it comes to, you know, the name Kurt, they've been around for a long time and there's a reason for it. So that's one of the manufacturers, at least in my opinion, uh, that you can't really ever go wrong with. And that'll finish up our look at of the Kurt gooseneck ball and safety chain anchor kit for the trucks that have the OEM prep package on our 2021 Ford F450.